the whole thing went down, except for that bow. Sonia and Dean Adi are still trying to figure out how to get their wrecked tugboat out of the Mississippi River. I'm devastated. It was our dream. You know, we're just devastated. The couple ran Mimi's Burger Boat, a popular floating restaurant for boaters, when they hit a wing dam near Clinton on Sunday night. We were avoiding a barge that was coming through the drawbridge. All of a sudden, just a grinding halt, just a, a loud grinding noise and uh, felt the boat rock a little bit and, um, and then we were stuck. It's like a geyser comes out of the bottom of the boat. It just blows the whole bottom of the boat open. With their two dogs and a 12-year-old helper on board, the tugs started to sink during the nearly three-hour rescue. Sonia took these cell phone videos from the bow of the boat. And the kitchen started taking on a lot of water all of a sudden, and the whole boat just all of a sudden just were sinking. I was afraid I was going to be electrocuted. Um, I got six freezers and refrigerators and air conditioners and everything plugged in down there and I'm, I'm in water to my waist. I'm losing everything right now. But we're alive. The burger boat was the Bettendorf couple's only source of income. Dean had just lost his job and they have limited insurance coverage. We only have liability because it's the unsinkable boat as we've been told. You know, it's a solid steel tug. Tonight, the tug still stuck. The Oddies now searching for a salvage company. You know, our main thing right now is just to get it off the wing dam and out of the water and hope there's no other issues with environmental mm -hmm. concerns. But It's going to cost a lot to remove it, and it's our income, and it's sitting in the bottom of the river. In Bettendorf, Chris Miner, WQAD News 8.